Hello, in this video I'll show you how to connect a PS3 controller wired to PSX X2. Firstly, you want to have your controller ready, obviously. Then your cable. It doesn't matter which cable it is. It could be Android phone or from the original one. But yeah, make sure to plug it in. And After that, uh, go on USB, set up USB game controllers. Click on that. Uh, mine says Xbox 360 since the one I bought. Uh, well, it's not necessarily the genuine controller, but it can still work but yeah if you even if you don't have the most uh, uh, authentic one this can still work with this method after that uh, click on properties and then you want to make sure the controller buttons work everything seems to be working every button but yeah now for the next step <coughs> you want to open up PSX PSS uh, X2 Go on config. Oh, let me move this here so it's easy to see. Uh, go on config, uh, controllers, plugin settings, and then since I already did pad one, uh, I'm just gonna redo pad two. Uh, you want to click on your controller that you use and everything. Uh, I already did this, but I'm just using this as a tutorial. Uh, click on L for L1, L1 obviously, and then L2. And then R1 over here, R2, D pad is obviously up, down, left, right, and then face buttons, square, circle, triangle, cross. For the L3 and R3, you want to click down on it on the analog stick, and then go up, left, down, right. And then for this one, click for the R3, then go left, down, right, up, and then you want to finish your select and start. And then after that, it's done. After that, you want to click apply. I already did this, so it doesn't matter for me. So I'm just going to cancel. You should apply. And then. After that, click OK, and then you're done.